Good morning. I'm sitting outside having my morning tea. Enjoying the weather before it gets a little bit too warm. There's a nice breeze this morning. There are a few clouds in the sky. Absolutely lovely. And as I'm looking out of my garden, I'm thinking of all the necessary chores I have to do. I'm thinking about how much I have neglected it the whole summer, literally. I only provided it with water, nothing else. I trimmed here and there for the rabbits and the guinea pigs. That's it. Picked fruit, picked herbs, spices, teas, picked vegetables. But other than that, I haven't done anything. No cleanup, no improvements. I just wonder, you know, when people come over and they look over this, they look over the, uh, the deck railing, what do they see? Do they see the work I have to do? Do they see the garden? I don't know. Even just entering the garden, isn't that lovely, all those strawberries? They started out from just three plants, believe it or not. But what, I don't know if other people see this or not. Maybe I shouldn't be pointing it out, but I just see what needs to be cleaned up. You know, I see all the things that have spread out, needs to be tidied. I mean, look at all this long grass. Now, it's not so bad. This grass is actually shading the ground. And I do trim it when it gets like this. The rabbits, the guinea pigs, they love it. And it's serving a purpose right now. It is shading the ground. But I just don't know if it's what people's eyes focus on when they look on this area. I mean, I just don't know. And look at this. This is where I have all kinds of winter flowers come up. And in the summertime, it, uh, it just gets grassy. Trim it back every now and then. Grows up really fast. This area in the uh, wintertime grows really nice flowers. And in the summertime, it, it gets grassy. But it's not really noticeable under the tree. But in through here, look at all this coming up through the wood, overgrown. Lots of overgrown. Look, I have thyme in here. It's interesting, the geraniums are actually protecting the thyme from the harsh summer sun. And the same for the grasses here with the oregano. Oregano needs sun, but not an incredible amount of sun. But I just wonder if when people look at this, do they look at all the work that needs to be done? Or do they see the garden? Do they see all the plants? I mean, let's come over here. Nice pond. And look over here. <clears throat> These are trees that I have mulched up. Do people notice that? Do they notice the mulch? Does it look messy, yucky? Well, I'm of the tendency to think at this point, of these young trees' lives, I mean, look at how young they are. They're very young. It's more important for me that they hold their water in. I mean, all of the trees in my yard looked like that at one time. See, this doesn't need the mulch as much. Hello, bee. I mean, look at these trees. They also have all this mulch. Do people see the ground and the yuck? Or do they see the trees and the new life that's coming along here nicely? I mean, let's take a walk. Let's look at my garden. When you're actually 
walking through my garden what do we see if I don't point out the mess does anybody see it I mean, yeah, it looks really natural, and I love it that it looks natural. But does it look, not necessarily bad, but does it look very unkept? That's my question. That's my question. Let's go back again. You know, it's interesting because beauty is different for each person. Everything is very subjective. And I've been told that the reason that I'm very self-conscious about the garden is because I'm the one who has to do the work in it. Um, true. But at the same time, I do want it to look nice. What do you guys think? Is it too run down? Until next time. <laughs>